Mega Feature Match. It's going to be uh, Cody Moran, who you didn't really see because he got yes, crushed did. so hard. Yeah. Round one, he's playing the modern. Yeah, the lag was too bad. He's playing a modern modern deck in Legacy with yeah. Legacy Duel Lands, Collected Company combo. And because uh, Anthony's playing some kind of blue white Terminus Avon Mind Sensor Wizard Cavern deck. It doesn't have counterbalances so in it. Is it like blue white, uh, blue white garbage. Yeah, blue white garbage. There, are, you know what, Sam Craven? There are actually no Delver decks in the the, the Greater no Atlanta Delver area decks. anymore. Exactly. <laughs> there are no Delver decks in Georgia. They they <laughs> they would come to Super Games. Uh, they would play four Chalice decks in a row. They would walk up and sell their deck to Polk. That's how it happens. You bring you bring the D. You're going home. I own like twelve Delvers that I've never ever cast. Well, actually, I cast them once in Standard, and I I went Delver Manalik. Manalik, Snapcaster Manalik, and I quit the game after that and just, just walked away. You just didn't want to play anymore? <laughs> I was like, this it. isn't magic? I was like, this is not fun. <laughs> so did you know that you could kill someone when you've turned one flipped over and then your opponent just goes like Trinosphere and you don't cast another spell all game? It's a pretty obnoxious card. So what, like turn one Delver or flip it? Yep. Like Spirit Guide Trinosphere? Or like... No, they go Trinosphere. They oh, go turn they one go three ball. Okay, yeah, you're yeah, like yeah. Delver, they're Trinosphere, uh-huh, flip Delver, yep, you're dead. Oh, is Delver banned? Okay. Yeah, is, is that the... Uh, yeah. yeah, it is. <laughs> Delver is actually banned in our chat. <laughs> you know, we can't get Brainstorm banned by in real, so ban Delver in the chat. You played shit at Giga. I got you. Yeah. That's, that's what it means. You were ashamed? I mean... Yeah, that, I mean, that's one of the games... That's what I was talking about is... I love when Trinster backfires. <laughs> During our testing for uh, the GP Nashville, where they had the Legacy or the Vintage Gen Con event, we were doing a lot of testing, and uh, I was playing five Ancestral Recall Delver against O'Brien, and uh, many of the games he was on shops. I just played Delver, and it flipped, and he that was it. He played a Sphere, and I didn't care, and I attacked him. That was it. That was, that was actually the game. Yeah. Was all she wrote. <laughs> So, what's interesting in this game? Uh, what is interesting in this game? We might see a brainstorm. What's interesting is Cousin Anthony has many creatures as a one of because he can't afford all of four of them. Do you see how ugly that is? Actually, Ron's got a good art. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I know there's a there's, there's a, this one. There's oh no, please no. Oh man, can we get the can we get the good one? I remember when I bought dual deck brainstorms because I thought they were like special and unique, and then uh, they printed in the conspiracy and I didn't care anymore. Look at this hand. Look he's at this got, hand. He's got nothing. Yeah. Yeah, so his deck plays <laughs> plays Engineer Explosive, Entreat the Angel, Avon Mind Sensor, Vendillion Click, yep. Stoneforge Mystic, Vincer. I don't think he's on Resto this week. I told him to play Resto because Resto's insane. He uh he mind censored me and it actually worked. He might yeah. He might you might have seen him last week. He mind censored BJ. <laughs> he mind censored uh BJ Ogden in response to a Kadotha Forge Master activation. Ooh. So BJ traded two Forge Masters and something for a Lodestone Golem, <laughs> which is really sub bad. Subpar, yeah. Uh, the only good white border brainstorms are the Korean fifths and the Chinese fifths. That's it. Which they're probably not on here. But uh, no, we can. We we'll just go to the Pimp Thread. Oh, that's that's ugly. Holy cow. That's yeah. Oh. Oh, turn one, he's going to fetch, and he's going to play a Sensei's Divining Top. So for those of you who don't know, uh, Divining Top is a magic card that is terrible. Oh, that's ugly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So so you, uh, one of the things, our local our local guys are pretty into the foreign stuff. Not so much in the foil, but more mostly foreign. Yeah, there's, uh, there's kind of a split. Uh, yeah. I saw Piper earlier. He's Piper's the foil, foil guy. I've got foil Maverick with my con. And, yeah, or, uh, 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 Chris Langston. Chris and, and Mike. Mike yeah. has full foil death and taxes. Yep. And then we have some people who are into uh, completely foreign. Into foreign. Uh, Cousin Anthony's one of those. He likes the Chinese cards. I'm I'm a Chinese fan. Yep. Hagen yes. here is full full out German elves. Yep. Uh, I've got Storm uh, mostly in Storm, German Storm, and Russian. Storm, too. Yeah. That yeah that eBay, eBay deal you got was sick. Uh, oh, he went. <laughs> he he tried to play a voice of research and it got spell snared. Guys, we're playing modern here. This is the format modern. So, if you can't beat him, you got to join him, right? You got to. I think this card is so powerful; it just hasn't found a good shell. Please ban Sensei's top. Yeah, banning so, sense. I mean, my I sideboard used to be three pithing needles. Now it's two pithing needles and a null rod. Null rod, <laughs> rod him. I think 
think you could just ban one mana instant wrath it'd be fine, right? Nah, BJ, we're talking about banning the card. I mean, the card is what makes Terminus good. Yeah, Terminus is crap. Well, I mean, just can we ban Brainstormers while we're at it? I don't know. Just don't have both in the same deck. <laughs> you just, you've never used either one of them, have you? I've played both, yeah. Oh, come on. I've played a one of Sensei Stop and Ant. One of Sensei Stop and Ant. See, we got we got uh, Alex. We got our our uh, Enchantress player over here dying of laughter from that last match. So usually I just play Silver Library instead. Uh, tell Cody to clean his cards. Uh, Cody's a dirty boy. I uh, played a Scavenging Ooze. Uh, I believe that's probably just going to be. I don't know what Cousin Anthony's going to do here. He has a Counterspell, a Jace, and an a EE e in hand. He's yeah. going to top it in step. See a Brainstorm. Oh, he's Brainstorm. Like, he had a Dig, though. Brainstorm, Dig, and Entreat. Um, so I think he should take the Brainstorm, cast the Brainstorm, try to find land. Yeah, yeah. He's he's desperate for land right now. Um, he's desperate for some... Do you... No, you don't. So, yeah. like, the Ooze isn't really a threat. Uh, it's a threat ooze does, I mean... It's a threat to his Dig through time, if, if Cody wants to... Not I think mana like he did that turn. Yeah, it. Cody's pretty not on that. Um. Top. <laughs> yeah, all the Dooms, all three people who play Doomsday are going to quit. So the problem with Doomsday is that, yeah, it has answers, but they're all really niche. <laughs> yeah, and Doomsday, like, you've seen it through the Vintage Super League. You can play it on Moto because you have all the time in the world to figure out your lines and win. But, you know, here in real life, we don't have time for you to sit down and do a puzzle in your head. Especially because most people who play Doomsday are just not smart enough to play Doomsday. All right, so Anthony's trying to find that land. He, uh, he did not find he's failing. Um, so he's going to be uh, he's gonna be in a world of hurt here for a second. No, there, there, there it is. Yeah. That's, uh, that's something. At least it produces mana. Oh, one of them did. Is that yours or mine? That's, that's, that's yours. Did his mic go out in Blaze of Glory, or is it, uh... Can you hear me? No. There's no button on the side, is there? No, there's not. Well, you guys weren't listening to John anyways. He's kind of a... Well, that. I don't know. Um, yeah, stuff happened. Uh, Ooze took damage, some stuff. 16. Some stuff, yeah. I'm going to see if I can figure out what mics. Let me see if it's actual mic. Let me put it in my computer. Okay, take a look. Yeah. I already did the replug. Um, that didn't do anything. But, uh... I'm going to... Why am I even talking? You guys can't hear me. I look like a clown. Mike is, uh, is talking... Or, John is talking to himself. <laughs> John's mic is not working. <laughs> How much did I miss, uh, Gavin? The answer's negative four. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Might be negative five, actually. You know what? It's not even a number. Go away. So Cody's doing a good job of not playing Man, relevant like... spells. Um, <laughs> Cousin Anthony, Cousin Anthony <laughs> has failed to put EE e. on two. <laughs> uh, there he goes. Okay. <laughs> he knows we're laughing at him. He knows he deserves it, too. Okay, it's not the headphones. It works over there? Yeah. Headphones sound great, but the mic's still out. Try, try another port. All right. Yeah. Uh, can you re-add it? Yeah, let me see if I can get that in. Uh, see if I can do that live or not. Oops. Um, I have to go through what, settings. Uh, I guess we're in three now. Yeah. Hello? We got two microphones responding now, so are you? Hey, there? can you guys hear me? Yeah, I guess they, I guess it's good. Because <laughs> an <amazing. laughs> Yeah, don't laugh on laugh on uh, Adam on the internet. He's an internet tough guy. <laughs> he can take all of us except one. So hopefully, up. Oh, yep. There oh, it is. Works. Okay, Sweet. thanks guys. That was pretty quick. Yeah, uh, love the deck name. Blue white garbage. Like uh, he's been on some kind of blue white, blue red, some some strategy like that. Oh man, you guys can hear me again. <laughs> Turn me back down. <laughs> Alright, so uh, Jace has uh, got two counters on him, I guess. Now that I can actually see it. 
I don't know if he's playing Narset in the deck today or not. I know he has one in his box. So, he couldn't find a uh, Snapcaster or an Entreat, and I think he ended up playing something else. I don't know. He's going to counterspell that Voice of Resurgence. Okay. Okay, the Witness is, uh, is trying to do something to the, the Jace, but it's not very well. He's going to top on Instep. Oh, he, saw, he found the one-mana Instant Wrath. Uh, he's also got an Entreat on top there. Oh, but, yeah, you don't want to make real Angels, do you? You just want to... Well, um... Angels would be real good right Cody now. can't deal with them. Cody's only removal is none, main board. How many he times did Brendan... didn't need any. Okay, that's true. We Instead of a punt counter, we need a seems good counter. It seems good, For yes. Brendan Hagen. Well, you know... You seems good? More, is that, uh... <laughs> <laughs> yes, Gavin, we, we all saw that. At the same damn time. <laughs> he's going to fetch holding priority on his uh, Entreat the Angels because he's not dumb. Well, you know. You're giving so us some like, credit. So HC on his... Uh, oh, as the host of SeemsGood.com, I volunteer to host. That's uh, Graven. <laughs> wow. All right. You're, uh, you're dedicated. He is dedicated. Dedicated to the cause. He lives in, I think he lives in Houston, so you have to be dedicated to live in Houston. As much as I love Texas, man, Houston was not my favorite place. Well, you know, at least you admit it. Yeah, I, I'm from an hour south of Houston, so, you know, will my donations be read on stream? We have not figured the, how, that out yet, but uh, we could do something like a... Uh, I don't even know where your donations are going. Yeah, we don't <laughs> We don't know where the money actually goes. It's going to the uh, Help DJ Fund. Hey, SFR Recon, what's up? Welcome to the stream. I hate you. You hate us, yeah. <laughs> yeah, if the money, the money's probably going somewhere with BJ, and BJ's not here, so the money's not coming to us. Oh, that's, that's my Noble Hierarch against three angels and a Jace. Three angels and a Jace versus no, Noble Hierarch? So, uh, uh, he has a Gavity okay. Township, too. Oh, there, yeah, if you yeah if you, if you you donate, we'll shout your name out. We'll definitely shout them out once I figure out where they are. Yeah, how to, how to do all that. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah. So Uncle Sean went to Vegas, and we didn't. The stream is not in Vegas. Not sure what we would do in Vegas on stream. I, I think they might prohibit cameras like this in most facilities. Most facilities would not like this. Yeah. High commentary would be quite amusing. <laughs> we could uh, we could do a private cast. I'll do a private show. Yeah, yeah we'll do it. Yeah, private show? Yeah, sure. How long until Piper pimps his deck out with... Piper doesn't like Arabian Nights. He likes foils. Um, yeah, I don't, he's always I don't think he'd ever do that. Yeah. I mean, we could... we could If you guys want to see the Pimpus burn deck in existence, we can do it. Yeah, we could play it. We could definitely put the Pimpus burn deck together. And then ask Sean to actually play it one week. We have to get someone drunk to play it, I think. Do you think Sean would ever play burn? Like, he's lent it out before. No, he would just hand that handle to one of us and tell us to drink and play. That's how this works. We you should get... tell him to like, take a shot every time he casts Lightning Bolt. Yeah, yeah, that's an idea. If you guys want to see someone take a shot every time they cast Lightning Bolt, I'll do it. <laughs> yeah. So, I'm just waiting for Cody to die here. Um... Does the Pimpus burn? No, I... I, I guess that's fair. We don't have the Pimpus because we don't have Summers. We just have oh, okay. signed Arabian Nights Mountains. Yeah, okay. That's uh, something at least. Okay, the so Sarah's we've lost here. we've lost track of the game because we thought Cody Moran was dead. And he's actually dead. Well, like Anthony played like a Dig Through Time and an Entreat and a Jace. Click, and I figured target. it was over. So. Oh, yeah, it's over. He's got a second Viscerous here, a Blood Artist, and a Malira. So, um, guys, uh, in case you just joined the stream, this is Legacy. Cody just doesn't know. Cody says, my hand is useless, and uh, Anthony agrees. <laughs> oh, he's going to put the red cap on top? I don't know why he's showing Kaz and Anthony. He's going to put the uh, all his cards underneath his lands. And pick it all up? Yep. The old scoop it up? And then draw five. Oh, he's gonna, Kaz and Anthony shows the, hey, I had two force to snap and a brainstorm. <laughs> well, the point of this first theory is that you go infinite with uh, Malira. And Kitchen Thinks are Murderous Red Cap. Yes. Um, because your creatures can't have counters placed on them, Persist does not function properly. Yeah. Uh, it attempts to put a counter on him, but doesn't. Yep. So you just, 
go infinite, you gain a million life if you have the Finx, or if you deal a million damage if you have the uh, red cap. Yeah, SFR, I, I really do like the full art lands. I like the both, I like all three of them. I like the Unhinge, Unglued, and the um, Zendikar. I think my favorite are just the originals. Just oh, the, 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 the uh, full arts. How about Judge Promos? Oh, the Judge, oh yeah, oh, the Judge Pro I think the forest is too murky. Yeah. The Guru lands are better, because they actually show their colors. Yeah. Like, I just... Oh, I think that was game, that was match. Force, yeah, because like they were they yeah. were 1-1. I don't. I think everyone else is in game three. So how long do we have in the this round? This should be the end 20, of the round. Yeah, soon. the round's coming up, guys. So uh, it's yeah, we're not gonna move seconds. anybody. Yeah. So yeah, I, I think my favorite basic land for mountains is definitely gonna be Saga, the ones that Piper was using. Okay. okay. Yeah. For the mountains. Okay. Yeah, the Zendikars are sweet. Um. See. What's the what's uh, the the Avon? Is that the one? The problem I have with Zendikars is that. I played during Zendikar. Oh. Everyone played all Zendikar basics in their decks, and I kind of got sick of them. Fair. Um, uh, and there's only, like, one good Zendikar mountain. It's, like, the Veronique or whatever. Okay. Veronique, yeah. Yeah. The rest of them are just not too fond of. The yeah. Jung Park one's okay. But, yeah. I don't know. I think I think the best part about magic and lands and stuff like that is you can choose how you want your deck to look. No, you can't. <laughs> I mean, it's just like... Uh, it doesn't matter what anyone thinks. If you're happy with your deck, because you're the one that has to look at it. See, it matters what I think, though. Um, yes, Brendan. It matters what Brendan thinks. So clearly, you have to you have to consider my feelings when you go into any kind of decision. John Avon Fantasy. Yeah. Um. Right now, I have all FBB basics in most of my decks, all Chinese ones. Uh, I'm trying to. I have. Let's go look through mountains. Yeah, I have Korean Tempest Planes to get signed by uh, the lady, Therese Nielsen. So I don't like this one. <laughs> Cody's over here giving things back because he's done. Are you? He has, quote, work in the morning. You can't play one more round with your, uh, your terrible deck in the 1-2 bracket? I mean, it did a lot better than I thought it would. Yeah, I saw that you did really well against Angels there. Did you? Oh, did you? What'd you do? Just collect the company him? No, I, uh, talked to, or I, uh, had red cap in my hand. He was at one. He went and just grabbed the marsh flats for the second round. Huh, that's... So this sounds nice, but it's new border and I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> what else is there? You crushed him that game. I mean, you mold the what? You mold the six? Yeah. You just had all the lands, all the attacks, and the double fire blast. Ah, uh, yeah, that's that's the one. Oh, that is the one. That's, that's the mountain right there. The mountain. Yeah. But see, the problem with that one is it's only only available in white border. So you have to I get an alterist. Yeah, you have to get a real alterist to uh, to alter them. Funny story about borders. One of our locals went to Invitational, and he borrowed a standard deck from me. And I had, like, a foil Korean Dissolve. And at that point, I didn't care, so I sharpied, I, I silver sharpied the border. <laughs> yeah, it was a silver border Dissolve. dissolve. Foil Dissolve. And uh, Brian was shuffling or whatever, and the head judge pulled him aside, saying, you need to check uh, with me about your altars before the event. Because that's apparently an altar. And, uh, and like, all I could all I could do is, like, what do you want? Let's see who... 